And twice a week, thousands of people arrive in Mobile after cruising to Mexico. On Monday, passengers on the Carnival ship Holiday made a stop in Progreso, Mexico. Now, when the ship returns to Mobile on Thursday, Border Patrol agents will be waiting, looking for anyone with sign of illness. Fox 10 News reporter Matt Barentine is joining us live now from the cruise terminal in Mobile. Matt, what can you tell us? Well, Carnival Cruise Lines was supposed to make two stops with the holiday this week in Mexico. Yesterday in Progreso and today in Cancun. Now, today's stop in Cancun was canceled by the cruise line, but they already made that stop Monday in Progreso. So officials say when the passengers get back to the port here on Thursday, they will have to be screened for possible viruses. Matthew Allen just returned from a vacation in Puerto Vallarta, Mexico on Monday. But before he could get back in the country, he had to go through a health screening at Dallas-Fort Worth Airport. At Customs, they had um, what looked kind of like a phone booth type thing they said was um, able to uh, detect whether or not somebody had a fever or was sick. Screeners also asked questions. Asking us if we'd had contact with, with any livestock, any animals, had been on a farm, had contact with with any, with any locals that, that may have possibly had flu-like symptoms. Passengers getting off Carnival's holiday in Mobile this Thursday will go through a similar ordeal. As folks disembark, Border Patrol agents will be watching them closely and looking for signs of sickness. Folks are ambulatory, sneezing, sniffling. I guess it look like they have a fever or look like they're out of sorts. Jim Walker with Alabama Homeland Security says anybody who looks ill will be questioned. They will be pulled out of their uh, place in line and taken to a holding area where some additional testing will be done and some counseling and, and uh, interviews and whatnot, uh, but then they'll be released. In other words, someone who is sick won't be quarantined. They'll be given some information on hygiene, told to stay away from crowds, and likely given a mask. And they will have those uh, on site, uh, both for our workers and for folks that they seem to feel are at risk. And after getting that mask and that information, they will be free to go home. Now, the holiday, like all cruise ships, does have medical personnel on board, so those medical personnel will be interviewed to see if there's any strange or flu-like illnesses while the voyage was going on. Now, in a release today, Carnival Cruise Lines did say that there have been no swine flu uh, cases on board any of their ships. And they say they will uh, change their itineraries. None of their ships will go to Mexico through at least May 4th. Lenise?